What's going on guys? What is good everybody? How you guys doing man? It's your boy Tylen in the building. Uh, today I got a reflex track showcase where I'm going to take a bunch of tracks and put them in one video. I'm going to do a first lap impression, my first lap ever on the track. And then I'm going to come back after I wrote a couple of laps on it and give you guys my full opinion on it, man. So if you guys are hyped and pumped, let me know down below. On top of that, if you watch this video, you enjoyed it and like to see more in the future, let me know that as well. And with that being said, let's do it. I'm focused, they stuck on that dope shit. Living for that true religion is broke shit. I can spin that on the Mac with a long clip flying that bitch, but you had First up, Green Corner SX by Nick DeLeon. Alright, so I'm going to do my first lap impressions and then I'm going to come back after I've written it for a while and give you guys my overall opinion after I got the rhythm for it and got the whole gist of how the track flows. So let's go ahead and check this shit out. Alright, so you go right right here. Got a nice little tabletop in this bitch. Got a split section. Oh, nice, nice. So far, I kind of like the track a little bit, man. I'm liking it. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. I'm down there, Ty. I'm liking it. Oh, my God. A triple a sketchy as fuck. Okay. Oh. Hey, Nick DeLeon, man. Your tracks are getting better and better, bro. They're getting better and better. Nice and high quality. This sense is killing me. Nice and high. Oh, that triple was fucking. Oh, my God. He killed me. He killed me. But this triple this section is is brutal. Damn, son. <laughs> Got on your P's and Q's in this bitch. Okay. Okay. That's some steep ass double doubles. This track is very uh, unforgiving. Very steep jumps. Oh my god, is that a line? Oh shit, am I doing something wrong here? <laughs> that was sketchy as hell. Wall jump, okay, okay. Oh god damn! <laughs> oh my goodness. Jeez, oh I'm stuck. Oh, let's, oh, let's back up. Let's, oh my god, bro. That wall is brutal as fuck. Hold on, let's get some momentum going here. <laughs> this sand is killing me too, god damn. Here we go, here we go. God damn. There we go. All right, this sand is uh ruthless, man. Oh shit! I'm liking this track so far. Nice dragon back there. Nice, I see, I see you. Oh, bro, the ten commandments in this bitch. What the fuck? This is dope. Bro, I like this. This is very unique. Wow, this is very unique. I like this little section here. It's simple, but yeah, it looks it's it's fun and challenging too. I, I kind of like this style of track. It's a little bit it's a little bit sketchy with how steep and sharp the jumps are, but it's still really really fun. Oh, that triple was insane! Jesus Christ! Oh my God! You like fire this? You, I, I'm guessing you can. I'm guessing you can fire that hoe. Triple? Oh my! You jumped that whole entire thing, bro. This track is off the chain. Bro. This track is off the chain. Very unique, too. I like how unique the. Oh my god, that finish line. That's one lap! Alright, well, I'm gonna do a few more laps here and get my rhythm on this track, and I'll come back with you guys and give you guys my full opinion on this damn thing. Alright, so I've done a few laps, got my flow here a little bit. Uh, before I start, though, I wanna say Nick DeLeon, man, keep it up. Your tracks. Are amazing now man you've come so far from where you used to be at this track right here is definitely a big leap in track quality track flow and the jumps man so please bro keep it up this shit is straight flames 
Now the first thing I want to say is this track is super technical. At least for me it is. This track will bite you on the ass if you let it. Man, if you case something, you're probably going to die. All right, you're going to die. But uh, I also like the different lines on here as well. You see right here, I double doubled it, but I'm pretty sure you can triple triple this section as well. And that goes for the whole entire track itself, man. Throughout the whole entire track, there's different lines you can do. You can quad stuff, you can double stuff, you can triple stuff. Like right here, you saw earlier, I triple tripled this, but right here I check up and then I triple out. So there's a lot of different lines just like this and even bigger lines you can do big old fives and quads and shit on here you can do and on top of that this sand is crazy all right not crazy this motherfucker is crazy this sand is like i don't know where i'm at man it's fucking quicksand this bitch but the sand on here is insane i like it it's, you know, it's challenging you know and like i said earlier you see right here i triple double you can double double through there there's a lot of different stuff now the 10 commandments or the 15,000 commandments coming up there's a lot of different lines through here as well check your boy out all right why and then that shit is lit let me stop let me stop but for real man look at this section right here as well you see there's a lot of different variation through here man you could do a big ass quad through here probably or something man also right here i figured out it's better to roll this so that way you can get this big gigantuan truck we got right here then check this out and then right here as well you can actually jump this entire section let me go ahead and show you guys after i get done casing this bitch let me, let me go ahead and show you guys how it's actually done that jump is insane all right i've cased that so many times it's hard as fuck to do and this section right here i don't know what to do right here this is like you can do a bunch of different stuff in this section i don't know what to do that goes for the whole entire track now usually i i take my time with this but since I'm doing more than one track this video, I kind of like, you know, rushed a little bit more. So I couldn't get all the lines I wanted to get. But at the exact same time, you guys get the gist of the track, man. It's an awesome track. Shout out to my boy Nick DeLeon for putting that major work, man. Like I said earlier, the reason I praise him so much is because this is definitely a more well thought out track than most of his other tracks are. So, man, Nick DeLeon, keep it up, man. All right, next track. Next, we got Uncorked by El Diablo. All right, so you guys already know how this goes. I'm gonna do my first lap ever on the track and see uh, my first impressions on it. And then I'm gonna come back later on and get my full opinion on this bitch. Now let's see, where we going here? Got a little split section here. Okay, I see let's go to the lower line. Okay, oh my God. Oh no, I'm alive. This is my whoop section there. Another one right here. Okay, I like the greenery here. It's just kind of lit. All right, what? Is this going to okay this is it's this is nuts i'm liking this this has like a a real like outdoorish feel man like i'm actually in the woods somewhere i like how glossy and dirty it is too she's wet <laughs> that's what she said she is wet okay, triple double there relish out of this what's this right here <laughs> Oh, oh, I like it. This track's very simple but very fun. Like, coming from that Nick DeLeon track to this is definitely a lot different. <laughs> double, double. Oh my god. Okay, got a canyon jumping that bitch. Got some rollers here. Double this bitch. Okay. What is this? Oh, okay, some more rollers. God damn. Weapon right there. Got some hucker bucks. Got some hucker bucks in hell. Yes, go, man. Got the Texan hucker bucks in that bitch. More whoops. Track is very, uh, very easy. Not too hard, not too technical at all. Just really a fast-paced track where you can hold that bitch tapped. Six gear. My bad, seven gears. <laughs> Let me stop. All right, what is this? Oh shit. I'm 12th gear tap, dad. Let's go. Let me stop. Dude, this track's cool, man. I'm liking it. This is very good. Uh, it's 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 like a uh, a competitive track. You know, it's not much to separate anybody. So it's like anybody's race here, pretty much. There's really no section here that's gonna separate anybody really too much. Oh my god, what is that? Oh, like a step on, step on, step off section. Step up. Nice, nice. 
This track almost feels real. How simple it is. Except for that big ass canyon jump, it almost feels real. Oh shit, whoa. Sitting sideways, boys in the day. Oh my god, I'm over here sliding left and right and shit. Whoa, what, what the fuck was that? Got a flat tire or something? Bro, chill, chill. It's not a drifting game. Go straight. Yeah. Ooh, that's, a, that's like a semi quad. It's kind of a triple, but it's quad with a little extra hump right there. Oh. Oh my god. It's pretty long, too. This is definitely like a cool little vibe track. Okay, that's one lap. Nice, nice. I like this track. It has a uh, it has a real cool vibe to it. Like you can get some battles going on here for sure, because it's not nothing here to separate you really. But alright, so I'm gonna do a few more laps here. I'm gonna come back with my, with my thoughts. Alright, so we back. So I've done a few laps here and this track is cool, man. This track is definitely, definitely a cool track. Now the first thing I wanna say about it is it's simple. It's a very simple track. But see the thing is, man, sometimes simple tracks are the best because they're fun to ride. You can kind of like have fun with your friends without really having to think extra hard about where you're going. You know, you can really just get on here and vibe to this track. Like I can put a movie on, uh, some music, and oh, where am I going? Oh shit, man, where are we going? <laughs> but uh, yeah, like I could put a movie on and some music or something and legit just vibe out to this track because it don't really take too much thinking power to ride this track. It's just a fun track. It has good flow to it. The jumps are fun. Um, I mean, he has some he has some pretty big lines on here too that will catch you off guard. But really, this track is just super simple, man. Super simple. You can lay this bitch over and rail these outsides and these big ass berms. It gives me a a, a realistic track feel, except for this part right here. Except for that canyon jump. I can legit see this track. It feels like a little bit smaller scale. I can see this track being real, you know, it's, it's just that mellow to where I can see myself doing these jumps in real life, you know. I probably wouldn't quad some of this shit, but, you know, I could definitely see myself doing some of these jumps on here. Like, this track kind of gives me, like, almost a cycle ranching feel. A little bit, a little bit. Not like, you know, you know, section for section, but it definitely gives me, like, a Texan... Texas track feel. It's just wide open. Got that reddish dirt. Got the trees, you know. Got the got the grass around the track and stuff. It definitely gives me a not a California track. That's for damn sure vibe to it. Definitely gives me more of a different, you know, you know, state feel to it. It's a fun track, man. I definitely can see some battles going on here. Uh, I can definitely see some bar banging in these corners because it's so big. You can block past and shout somebody in these corners. Um, Got nice little trails here. That's pretty dope. I think is this right here? You come right here. You can actually you go to this left side and you like just five this bitch. That shit is nuts. That shit is dope. You can five that like a five step on and step off. That's sick. I like that man. I like that shit a lot. Now it didn't take me long to get used to this track because even the first lap I kind of already had it. I wouldn't say down. I, I didn't know where I was going per se. But like it was it was easy to read where you jump and where you go and what you launch and stuff, you know. Definitely a track for battles. Definitely a competitive track. Like you go to Nick DeLeon's track we just rode. That track is more I would say it it will separate riders. Like if you're not a good rider, you're gonna get left behind Nick DeLeon's track. This track right here, you could not be as good at the game. And still keep up. You know, it's not too much here that's going to separate anybody. You know, everybody can do everything here. It's pretty easy. But a very fun track. I like tracks like this where you can kind of just, you know, relax and ride the shit rather than having to think and, can I quad this? Can I, can I, you know, can I fire this? Whoops, are kind of hurt. You no, know, crazy here. Can I blitz them or should I jump through them? You know, this track is just, you know, I'm going to jump this shit here, launch this shit, bust a big ass fat whip here, you know. Really easy track. Very fun track, man. Very, very fun. All right. Let's go ahead and head to the next track, my boys. And next up, we got Skit Hybrid by my boy White Wolf. Let's go ahead and check it out. All right, guys. You already know how we do it. First lap impression. Let's get it. Let's 
my first time. Oh, you got all the banners here? Oh, wait, hold on. Scooty got G Garcia. My boy, uh, Jamie T. What's got over here? Goonzik. Jack D. Okay, let's go. Let's go. My man. Oh, hey. This track is kind of noise. I see you, White Wolf. Oh, shit. Ooh, nice little inside there. Hey, White Wolf. Bro. My first lap, I'm already kind of blown away here. Wow, I like the quality of it, too. The textures are fucking nice. Shout out to uh, DS19 for the textures, man. That's a big ass double. Oh, shit. God damn. These ruts, though. Oh, my. Ooh, these whoops. Man, I'm loving the textures. DS19, bro. Dark Slide shouts you, my man. Looks amazing. The track is dope as fuck, too. Triple? Oh, oh shit. Table tie. That's different. Oh, my God. Look at this finish line. God damn. Oh, okay. Who we got? 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 K1066, you got Merlin, you got Tog, got another Tog, got Merlin, K1660, you got Heckman, you got my boy Marcus, you got Benny. What's up? He got me as fuck. Oh, I see how it is. White Wolf, that's cold blooded, bro. That's cold blood. What happened to me? Huh? What happened to me, man? What happened to me? No, I'm just playing. All right, let's go ahead. I'm going to do a few more laps here, and I'm going to come back, and I'm going to give you guys my thoughts on this. All right, so first thing I want to say is, man, big shout out to Dark Slides for the dirt textures and the bump models. This track looks phenomenal, man. White Wolf, keep it up. This track is dope, my boy. Now, the first thing I want to say about the track itself, uh, this reminds me of a backyard built Supercross track for like an amateur rider. You know, like, say you have a kid that wants to like go pro on Supercross, but he's still an like, amateur rider, so you throw some, you know, kind of dumb down supercross jumps in there like you know not that crazy whoop sections you know not that crazy of a step on step off section you know got some big doubles you know it's a lot of big doubles in supercross tracks at the finish line and stuff like right here you know you got that big catapult jump that arena cross mostly is known for um and you got like these big ass ruts in here which gives the outdoor feel you got this chewed up you know whoop section gives that outdoor feel this really gives me the vibe of a backyard built supercross track now i love the vibe of this i love the flow of the track as well Man, this is a very fun track to me, man. I, I like it mostly for its natural feeling. I feel like I'm at home somewhere, you know. I feel like this is my track in my backyard. So the only negative I have to say about this is that I wish the track was longer. It has a good vibe, good flow to it, man. So White Wolf, keep it up. Shout out to my boy Dark Slides for the textures and the bump matulus. Shout out to my boy C4 and Red Rider for helping them out, uh, you know, get the banners and objects and, you know, the other details and stuff to help people build tracks. All right, guys, that's it for today, man. I only got three tracks, but if you guys would like to see me do more tracks in the future, let me know. I'll grab some other tracks that are older uh, that I liked back in the day, and I'll bring them on here. And I'll do, like, maybe five to ten tracks every now and then, you know. So if you guys enjoyed this, let me know, and I will see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching. Peace. Have a nice day.